are we within normal health care emergency? Now, until they make it through the first loop of the block. So I was born and raised in southern Indiana on a little beef cattle farm. I uh, attended a very small rural high school, played Indiana high school basketball, and attended Indiana University. Did my PhD jointly between the University of Denver and the University of Colorado Medical School, and then did a two-year postdoc at the University of Colorado Boulder. Was then in biotech for about five years before coming to CCU. He is equal parts brilliant and terrifying, mostly terrifying because of how brilliant he is. Uh, but the more I had him in class, the more I realized he's an extremely caring professor. He had a great sense of humor, which made his class so enjoyable and also super informative because he's such an expert in his field. And he ultimately continues to push our focus towards what really matters, which is continuing to follow Christ. I love the interaction with students and feeding into their lives. And one of the wonderful things about CCU is you get to feed into them not just knowledge, but also help them mature in their faith and their understanding of God through their understanding of the natural world. He's got great rapport with the students and the faculty alike, and he has a, a knack for bringing his faith to uh, his profession in a way that uh, leaves you feeling like the Creator is awesome. He brought real you know, industry and practical experience to the classroom. And he also was a close enough mentor to me that he helped me make a lot of like key decisions as I was leaving school so that I was in a good spot five years from then. My wife and I will have been married 20 years in September. We have three boys, 16, 10, and eight. So we have a very loud and <laughs> vigorous household, let's just say. I love to ride dirt bikes. We have a ski boat. We have wave runners. If it's outdoors, we probably like to do it. And I like to do little more adventurous things. So for instance, a year and a half ago, I took my dirt bike to Mexico and rode into Baja by myself. I would hope that students would get from me the encouragement to think for themselves, to never have been told what to think, but always been told how to think by me. I'll have former students who come to me and say, boy, at the time, I thought you were so hard, but now I appreciate the way you challenged me. I was well prepared for graduate school. I was well prepared for medical school. I was well prepared for my career by being challenged, both intellectually and spiritually. My greatest hope for students is that they're able to use and appreciate the gifts that God gave them and the tools that He gave them to find their place in His plan.